Hello Lola's, welcome back to my channel guys. Yes, I know y'all probably like this chick always popping up with a video promising us a live, never come live. Let me tell you something. I got some real serious migraine type issues that just like to pop up only when I tell you guys I'm going live. So how about I'm not going to tell you guys when I'm going live, I'm just going to go live because every time I say I'm going live, I promise y'all that's the only time in life I get a migraine. Like my head don't like y'all. I like y'all but my head don't like y'all. Okay, just kidding. I love you guys. Um, guys, if you're not subscribed to this channel, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. Because you see this cute little boy? Oh, gosh, y'all don't want to miss him. Make sure y'all smash the... Oh, no, no, no. No, yeah. Smash the subscribe button, but ring the bell. No, click the bell. Because some of y'all are really be trying to figure out, like, how do I ring the bell? Um, Serenity, there's no way to actually ring it. Okay, so click the bell. So you, you can be a part of the notification squad. And guys, if you want to be a part of the chatterbox, please do so by clicking the link in the description bar. And also, <laughs> get your merch. And what else can you do? What else can you do? Oh yeah, make sure you follow me on Instagram. Now, let's just get to this baby here. So this is my rare, rare, very rare, sweet, sweet sweet baby you know I really really I named him Noah but I really should have just named him Kingston because I, I always want to call him Kingston I mean seriously um I, I I always almost call him that but anyway Noah is the willow asleep sculpt you guys know by guess who Claire Taylor dolls and he is prototype number two actually um, so I'm going to get him changed and just chat with you guys while I do that. Oh my goodness, honey, y'all got some mess going on, honey. Y'all, y'all be tripping me out with what's, with y'all the cat fights that y'all be having going on in this community. I, you know, like I told y'all, I be trying to keep my little distance between those squabbles, but honey, y'all be a funny mess. Some of that stuff just be looking like. You remember how I used to watch wrestling? I don't know about you guys. I used to watch wrestling with my um, my um, my grandpa, and my grandma used to be yelling, "Turn that old fake shit off!" And I used to be like, "Uh-uh, grandma, this is real. This is real." Okay, I wasn't saying it like that back then, but I but I always thought it was real. And my my grandpa, he never really disputed it, but he just used to be like. Kate, Kate, let, let, let us watch the TV in peace. And we, we would just be, you know, sitting there just enjoying it. But Grandma would always say it was fake. But it looked real to me, you know, because I ain't know no better. Child, that's how I be looking at these some of these little stage uh, cat fights <laughs> that be going on. But anyway, um, so I am... Really, really enjoying my little boy. Yes, I am. So I have had him in that same little outfit for a while. I haven't actually. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you guys. I haven't actually had a chance to really get much done in my nursery as far as painting, as far as finishing up what I was working on, as far as getting everything cleaned in here because. Oh, work's been whip, whipping my behind and I got, I started not feeling well with the migraine and the um, pollen is really bad and I don't have to go out, but um, on certain days, which is um, not that much and when I go out, I always seem to have problems with my allergies on those days. Oh my goodness. And I, I just, I'm just so over it. So, yeah. But yeah, I am just so excited. I Let me tell you guys, I have, this is my confession. I was going to tell y'all the tea the other day. 
So I am expecting to be painting me a baby for myself. And I am so excited because I have all these clothes. I have all these girl clothes that I've been nesting and I've been buying, I've been shopping. And I don't know about you guys, but this whole pandemic has been a disaster for my um, shopping habit. It's not helping me um, because that's all I do. And I have, if it's not for my grandbaby, it's for the babies. And so I bought all these cute little girl clothes. I'm not going to do a haul on her stuff because I kind of just want to keep it to myself until I actually get whoever she will be and she wears it. So, well, you got on a pimple just like your brother. Y'all been wearing these pimples for 25,000 years. <laughs> so, um, what's that on your finger? All right, I ain't going to bother with it. Um... But yeah, so what was I saying? Oh yeah, so I well, that's the thing. So I'm planning on painting me a baby and um, a silicone baby because I need a full size silicone, silicone girl. I do have my blank fin. I do not plan to paint that fin. I'm hoping that someone will be looking for a blank um, fin and will buy my spot from me. Um... I just I just decided with the two boys because right now I'm trying to focus on not buying dolls that I'm going to eventually sell and just buying dolls that I plan to keep um or not buying um say you know just yeah so I am actually in a weird, funky kind of collecting mood right now. Like, I am really into my, my vinyl babies. But I am ecstatic about the silicone still at the same time. So, okay. So whenever my money flow changes to where I really can't afford to splurge on silicone. I gravitate towards my reborns for some reason usually because they're more affordable. But with me painting myself the silicone myself now, it opens up a make it a little bit more affordable for me, but not by enough to where I can just buy every single kit. So I have to pick and choose what kit I actually will buy for myself. So, I'm not going to tell you guys what I usually say and say I'm not going to buy any more expensive prototypes or anything like that. What I'm going to say to you guys is that um, if I can afford to do it, I will do it because they are absolutely amazing. Um, I have yet to find anyone that can reach the the depths and the details of clear teller painting um and so with that being said i will always seek to buy her her completed dolls if i can um rather it be kit or um let me show you guys him on his back Rather it be kit or rather it be um, doll. To me, once she paints it and do the whole thing, it's a doll. Rather it's the the kit or not. So his hair is a little messy, but that's okay. We'll we'll brush that out. But this is him on his little back. His he is so freaking detailed. Like his. This is a dark skinned baby and a lot of people think dark skinned babies can't have detail like they can't be modeled or heavily detailed. Let me tell you something. If you were to see him in person, he has just as much detail as Nigel. Like literally he has so many veins and his back is so modeled. Look at this. That's so soft and soft back. It's so soft. Look at that. <laughs> 
I love, 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 love him. Let me show y'all. Let me see if I can zoom in. Let me see what you guys see. See if I can zoom in. Um. But yeah. All right. I don't know if you guys can see, but he is just as detailed as um as Nigel. He's just there we go. He's just a, a darker baby. So I'm gonna flip him over in hopes. Let's see if I can get him back to where he was, but I just wanted to sh show you guys his his back. <laughs> Little boy, you're exposing how I just lay a blanket up cheap. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. And boom. Okay. There we go. I'm so sweet. There we go. Now let me make sure I got y'all got him in the full frame. But yeah, so I will always seek after her dolls because there is no other ones like it. But um when I can't and if I can afford a kit, I will probably try to collect kits from now on for the most part and paint one myself when I can't and then my other thing is I will paint my um my reborns and paint some for myself because it's hard to say that you will never collect again when you're a collector when you're a real collector you and you love dolls as long as I've loved dolls I've loved dolls all my life um I can go back to being, I think maybe three or four years old and I had dolls. So, and I was carrying them around with me. I remember I've always like, I used to take them in the store with me. So me and my grandma used to go grocery shopping. I used to have them in the cart, <laughs> in the grocery cart with us. I remember they all had names. I remember some of their names, Sandy and Patricia, um, just some of the buddy, just the name a few. <laughs> um, those were some of my favorites, just so you know. Um, Patricia was a redhead. And then I had my strawberry shortcake. I had my little pony. I never really played with it. I didn't like fictitious like things. Like I didn't like the only cartoon now. I don't know why, but I like the Smurfs and I like the Snorkels. But usually, and I think the Smurfs act as normal little people. But I didn't like like um, cartoons that didn't appear to be like realistic or something. I don't know how to explain it. But anyway, I'm just gonna match the yellow in his Tigger. If, if that makes sense. I'm not gonna it's not necessarily gonna match his other stuff. But um anyway, so I am not gonna say that I'm not gonna be collecting. I'm slowing down a little bit because I don't know what's a, I'm slowing down on well I'm not slowing down. I just I may not be able to afford to buy like a very, very expensive one right now, which I am craving. I am definitely craving a very expensive baby and I say it's not that I'm craving I'm craving to pay a big price I know that it would be expensive for what I have in mind of what I want but um I, I want a baby with um, the squishy tummy and the spine now I miss that in my collection so I do, I do, I do, I do. I really do. But, to be honest, if I don't ever get that, I will be perfectly okay. Just simply because, I'll be honest with you guys, the kits are amazing. I love their silicone. And see, for me, for me, somewhat of like what my one friend was saying, um, my other collector friend was saying for me with the silicone I love I just love the feel of them but it is about 
the painting too but I love the feel and I'm definitely more about the sculpting than anything um I can forgive some things when the sculpt is dependent on the sculpt <laughs> um some stuff I, I, I can't get past because of sculpting so sculpting is number one for me oh my god I love him <laughs> This is why you guys barely see him because he's always like in my room in his little bed where I can see him all the time. Sometimes I turn that thing on. But that is him. Now he does have a, a binky but I don't normally like Noah with a binky. So that is my guy. Let's see. I'm going to turn him that way. I don't want to turn him too much over to the side because I sprayed. And I don't like the way I brushed his hair down right there. All right. Sometimes you can just mess it up with your your hands. Sometimes just mess it up. Just to give that. Because baby's hair are not like perfectly lined. You know, I know a lot of people like it all, everything's so perfect, but it's not usually perfect. It's usually kind of like sporadic, just kind of a little messy. So I like it a little messy. There you go. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy watching Mr. Noah Pooh. And um, yeah, so. Um, his edition is sold out because people ask me this every time. He, the, there are some kits out there that are being painted. So maybe you can get one painted close or similar, which is perfectly okay. Cause there's artists out there that can, you know, you know, give their best shot at it. And then, um, there is, but other than that, the kit is sold out. And then the Willow Awakes, I don't know how many is left. Oh, I, I don't want to say the wrong thing. But there are a few left that she hasn't put out yet. So you can go to her website and I guess you'll have to just subscribe so you'll be notified when the next ones come out. And then you find an artist to paint them for you, paint and root for you. Um, which the Awake looks like Nigel. So, but... The sleep is sold out. But there's my Noah Noah. Alright, talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.